And can you feel the love tonight? It is where we are. It's enough for this wide-eyed wanderer that we got this far. Minus the horrible singing, I am so excited for this video. It is my first time watching the teaser trailer for the new Lion King live action movie from Disney that it's coming out uh, next year, July 2019. I am so excited. Uh, this teaser trailer has been out for a couple days already. I've been wanting to film this video. I haven't been able to. And finally, lo and behold, here I am filming it. I have the Blu-ray right here, The Lion King. The Lion King from, I believe, 1994. That is when this movie came out. Um, I was four years old when it came out. The Lion King, one of my favorite Disney movies of all time. One of the greatest Disney movies of all time. How can you hate this movie? How can you hate The Lion King? Or even dislike it? Or just say, it's mediocre or just okay? The Lion King is not just okay. Uh, everything about this movie is brilliant. It's fantastic. I don't even have to tell you to go watch it because odds are you have seen it already. And if you have not seen it already, then you just, you know, get away from me. Do not watch this video. Turn it off right now. I don't want to associate myself with you. Just kidding. Um, you are missing out if you haven't seen it. Anyway, so this is my first time watching the teaser trailer. I'm so excited. Um, so let's get into it. Oh my god, started early. Okay, turn up the volume. Okay. Let's try that again. Here we go. Oh my god, it's just like the animated movie. The light touches. And they got the original voice actor for Mufasa's voice to voice Mufasa this movie. Rises and falls like the sun. One day, the sun will set on my time here and will rise with you as the new king. <gasps> Sorry. Oh my god. Simba. 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 Oh my god, he is the cutest thing ever. Oh my god. That's it? my god um okay so that was very okay i don't know i loved it a lot but my one complaint was that it was way too similar to the animated movie at least with the teaser trailer for aladdin um they kind of changed it up a bit but with this i felt like it was frame by frame exactly like the animated movie Obviously, this movie's just a cash grab for Disney. They're gonna make a billion dollars, if not more, off this movie regardless because it's The Lion King, just like Beauty and the Beast. I will say I'm a little disappointed with that trailer just because shot by shot, it's the exact same thing as the animated movie. And to be honest, I don't want that. I want something new. I want the essence of what this movie was, you know? I just don't, I don't want a frame by frame remake of this movie so though it was epic i don't want to be blinded by the epic music and the epic you know mufasa's voice what have you i will say i was a little disappointed by that teaser trailer because it's just exactly like the animated movie so i will watch it again because that's what i do in these videos um so let's get into it the sunrise yes See, frame by frame, it's exactly like the anime movie, and they should have, I don't know. Everything the light touches is our kingdom. But a king 
The CGI is beautiful, though. I mean, it's a live-action Disney movie. Obviously, the CGI will be on point. One day, the sun will set on my time here. Mm -hmm. I'm not looking forward to the stampede scene, though. I don't want to see Mufasa die. It's going to be very sad. Rafiki, Simba is the cutest thing ever. Oh my god. Seth Rogen. James Earl Jones. That's Mufasa's voice. Um, Beyonce is doing the music. Uh, and she's voicing Nala. I don't know. I have mixed feelings about this. Um, I don't know. I, I'm honest. I'm not genuinely as excited to see this movie as I was for Aladdin. At least, like I said, with the Aladdin teaser trailer, they kind of changed it up a bit. Um, but with this, it's just a frame-by-frame frame exact of the movie, and I don't know, even, I almost wish they didn't get, what's his name, the guy who voices Mufasa, I already forgot, James Earl Jones, I almost wish they didn't get him to voice Mufasa, because it's like, it's too much, you know, it's just too much of the same, and will I see this in theaters, of course, but I will say I'm a little disappointed by this teaser trailer, it's epic, but it's not original by any means, I feel, it, it almost seems lazy, you know, it's like, how do we make a billion dollars, you know, how do we make 1.5 billion dollars, let's do a frame by frame remake of The Lion King, um, I don't know, uh, I'm excited for it, but I, I'm not, I wasn't blown away by the teaser trailer, to be honest, um, I am looking forward to the real trailer that will be coming out maybe next year sometime. And they still have to release the official trailer for Aladdin. Um, I watched the official trailer for Dumbo, I think it was last week, and I thought that was a beautiful trailer. Um, I'm more so excited for Dumbo and Aladdin than I am this movie, which is a little disappointing. Um, but anyway, leave your comments, leave your opinions. What did you think of the teaser trailer? Are you excited? Were you disappointed? Did you love it and you don't care? That's a frame-by-frame -frame remake of The Lion King. You just want to see a live action on the big screen. Um, hopefully they kind of changed it up a bit. I know with Beauty and the Beast, Beauty and the Beast had the same problem. It was like the same thing frame-by-frame, -frame, like the same dialogue and everything. But they found ways to kind of change it up as well. Hopefully they do that with this movie. Um, anyway, that is my first view of this trailer. I hope you guys enjoyed watching, um, and I will see you next time. Bye.